Hey guys, I'm back with a new hair review and I had to beat my face and everything because I didn't do my makeup at work but I did my makeup for the video. I just did a little bit of concealer because I'm still trying to stay away from the makeup because I've been breaking out like freaking crazy and I don't know what's going on. But I'm back with this new wig review and it's the Janet Nikki wig. Now this wig is not familiar to YouTube. This this is very familiar to YouTube. This wig been out for four years and everybody did reviews on this from deep purple to black to blue this week got every color in the bible so it comes like this and looks like this and actually it don't even look like this in person when you look at mine you can see the part super duper wide so i just put some concealer and make sure you use some lighter concealer so that you can see the part but it does come more wider you can take your um tweezer and um tweeze it but it's just um messy bob but like it has like a lot of body and curls this is the old et1b slash burgundy so it has the black roots but it has the burgundy at the bottom it's just like these deep curls you can comb it out you can use a brush you can use a comb but i really didn't do nothing to it yet i just like kind of like feathered the front because i like the feather look you can also take it down like this and wear it like this and it's just life like when the girl was, me and the girl was looking at the wigs in the store and we was just like, oh my God, because there was another one like this, but it just looked at real like stiff. But then when we found this, she was like, no girl, get this. And I was not expecting the curl to be soft and like bouncy and just, it just had so much body. Like this is that fresh, like spring, summer bob. Like this is definitely the right bob for fresh, like around this, um, around this heat weather where it's like warming up a little bit so this was perfect to get it um on wig types or um sam's beauty it is like 17 to 15 dollars but me i went to the hair store so i actually paid 44 dollars which wasn't bad because the quality is really really good i feel like if you want something good you have to pay the money for the quality and i don't know people are saying the same thing that it's still it's soft i haven't seen no bad reviews on this at all everybody everybody liked the messy bob look like the um angela bassett look when she was on the red carpet so yeah it's giving me that look um like with some big hoops or some big earrings work or like an office or like you want to interview this is definitely a wig you should get um it's like the multi two tone two tone layers it has like the baby hairs in the front you can pull them out in the side but i didn't do that but if you want to put some edge control you can i just put a couple cornrows in there with a wig cap the cap size um is a little big because on this side you can see it's big and i just edge control it up and i pulled my cap up that way and measure up but even me tightening it it's still a little bit bigger but it's okay. Um, they, they do have adjustable straps in the back. They have two combs in the front, a comb in the back with adjustable strap. So you can straighten it. Um, I think this is curling now. So let me look. It says ombre on the back. Curling iron directions is 360 degrees. Hold it for 30 to 60 seconds. Do not overlap the hair. A thermal curling iron. I want to use the curling iron on this. It, always had, it already have like the body and the texture. And the girl said that once it get a little bit old, you can use the um, oil sheen or any type of spray oil. And I did see somebody on YouTube using that mist spray. So if it get a little like old. But I like these wigs, these curly ones, the bottom ones when they get older. Like when they're freshly new, they're like, like bouncy all over the place. But before the sun go down, this is the side. And this is the back. And it's like... 14 inches it do stretch it's a good length for work because i'm not i don't have to do nothing i don't have to flat iron i just have to put a bonnet on i don't sleep on it i just put a bonnet on and put it back on in the morning you you don't want to sleep in it because you want to keep your curl pattern but if you do just use like a netted cap or use like a set and bonnet that way the curls will stay and when i was testing it out it actually rolls like a pin curl like and it stays like that like, it's so bomb. I haven't seen this in the Janet collection, which is super weird. I think when you go on wig shopping, you got to look for the wigs because some of the ones I've been looking for, I can never find. But 
I'm wearing it like this so that it will fall down. I guess you can wear it exactly like this. I'm going to get up close because the sun is going down, guys. It's about to rain again. Um, But, yeah, that's it. Um, It has two combs in the front, one comb in the back, adjustable straps. I didn't experience no shedding yet because it's brand new. It's a soft, yakky texture, which means the curls are going to be in there for a minute. It's almost like a wine curl and you just flat iron your bang. Um... Yeah, the texture is like a soft, yakky texture. It's not too thin. It's not too thick. But it's like that glamorous, like, bob curl, like red carpet curl. It is ombre. You can put the concealer in the middle and you can make baby hairs. It's up to you. You can wear it down. You don't have to wear it like I'm doing it. But it's just various ways. This week do come in, like, 20 colors. And I'm in this video because the sun is going down and i hope you enjoyed this little bob wig review and i will talk to you guys in my next video